Hello everyone, Dolphin Oracle back again, and tonight I'm looking at StreamTuner, a internet radio application found in your sound and video menu. That's right here called StreamTuner 2. And it's going to take a minute to load a bunch of modules for different internet radio streaming broadcasts. You can configure that so Stream Tuner so it doesn't load these every time. Honestly, some of these work for me, some of them don't. Uh, there's probably some configuration things that you have to do. Uh, but for me, I, I kind of like the Shoutcast uh, servers, and they will they have different music radio stations, as you can see. All these are internet radio stations, and by and large, they're all here. Now, sometimes the list can be a little old, or our station may not be there uh, like it was in the past. We've changed to a pop. Now we've got pop stations. If you select one, it will play. You can click the play button. Then you can see that XMS Media Player will open up and it will play the stream. Now i got the meter up here so you can see that it's playing. I don't think you can hear it um, in the video, but it is playing, playing music. And you get all the stream info of the particular song here or actually the particular radio station. Now, one of the neat uh, but there is a configuration issue with Stream Turn 2 as it ships with Antics and that is it doesn't automatically point to the correct media player. So you need to open up properties and come here to where it says audio slash mp3. Actually any of these for audio slash you need to change it to XMS. It's going to say audacious by default we don't have Audacious installed on the system. Now you got two options, either install Audacious or just point it to XMMS. It works fine if you do that. You got some other neat things. You got zip.org. Some of this is international. Uh, it's pretty cool. I was listening to a little salsa music earlier. Kind of made me happy. Um, uh, you can input your own stations too as well and you get a little bookmark feature over here uh, that you can uh, bookmark and, and and, and your you know favorite favorite channels. It's a great little application if you just want a little background noise or you want to listen to the radio. It's a nice little tool to do it. For tips, tricks, how to's, head over to annex.mepis.org or throw up a post at annex.freeforms.org. It's Dolphin Oracle signing off. Have a great night.